Wow, you look great. Right, are we ready? I'm not going to come to the party tonight, Tom. What? I've been thinking I need space. But we just spent a lovely night together. I know it seems sudden, but... Everything was going so great. I met your parents. We were supposed to go on holiday. I'll let you wear my Dylan top to bed. Okay. Because you're like the biggest music nerd I've ever met. This may help. Do you remember how much I used to like this song? So we listened to for weeks. Right. And it's not like I don't like the song anymore. I mean, I still love the song. It's just when I listen to it now, I don't get the same feeling. Okay. I press the skip button. Right. I'd rather listen to something else. Are you breaking up with me? It's a great song. Seriously, mate. You want to forget about her. She treated you like shit. She cheated on you how many times? Six and a half times. <laughs> Six and a half? Yeah, it was a party at Michael's, second year. I got wasted, I passed out in the bedroom, and Jess comes in and pounces on me. <laughs> How is that cheating? But whilst we're having sex, she calls me Graham. <laughs> you can't count that. People say weird shit all the time. <laughs> this one time I called a girl Mum. <laughs> <laughs> Mum? That is disgusting. Oh, anyways, I jumped up, ran over, turned the lights on, and she freaks out. Turns out she thought I was Graham Payne. Oh man, that is rough. Yeah. <laughs> so doesn't that tell you everything? I mean, look at me. I haven't had a girlfriend in years and I'm doing fine. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> you got blinded by love, mate. It happens to the best of us. What about Sophie? She's a great girl. She's lovely. She ticks all the right boxes. It's just not the same. I think Jess and me were meant to be together. Well, then the four of you need to sit down and have a serious talk and sort it all out. Four of us? You, Sophie, Jess, and Jess's fiance. Fiance? Yes!